Support for KQED comes from Integrated Resources Group with showrooms in Brisbane, Dublin, and Sacramento. IRG. Surfaces. Selection. Service. MarbleCompany.com. Hey there, how you doing? I'm Ryan Farr from 4505 Meats and 4505 Burgers and Barbecue. We're gonna make our best damn cheeseburger. The grass-fed beef balances with all the other bold flavors in this burger in the bun and then with the Gruyere cheese. Here's our quarter pound, 100% grass-fed, grass-finished burger patty. Uh, I really like the quarter pound because it's not too big. It's a good burger you can have and not feel too full and need to go take a nap. But first, let's make our secret sauce. So we call this our shh sauce, it's secret mayonnaise, ketchup, and we're gonna add our relish. Good pickle flavor. And the mustard, the amount of mustard in here, that's one thing that's kind of unique about our secret sauce. I'm just mixing everything together. So here are our butter buns. Inside the buns we have cheese, butter, green onions, and sesame seeds on top. Gonna add a little butter here. For me, the key to a good burger bun, or really any bun, since there's butter inside the bun as well, you really need to be toasting both sides to warm that butter up so you don't have kind of a dry, crumbly bun. All right, we got our butter buns, our grass-fed burgers, let's go cook them. First, we're gonna put our buns on because we wanna make sure that those get plenty of time to toast. For our burger patties, we just use salt. All right, our burger patty consists of 75 lean meat, 25% fat. Uh, I re really like that because it can give you a lot of flavor and also moisture opposed to something that's a little leaner might come across as dry. All right, these guys are looking good. Yeah, it's like that really nice kind of toasted uh, bun. It's perfect. All right, so let's go ahead and get our cheese on. Not a big fan of pressing the burger. We press it, but you're gonna lose a lot of that fat and we like to serve our burgers mid-rare. All right, so they're pretty much almost done. It's really fast to pick up since they are a quarter pound patty. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take it and land it right on the bottom buns. All right, so now you can see with the bun, we got nice toasty top there. We got toasted sesame. It's got um, a little crunch, a texture. So we're gonna go ahead and build these burgers now. Red onion's got really nice sweetness. We're gonna take our top bun. Don't shy with the secret sauce. Burger's not a burger unless it's a messy burger. I'm gonna go ahead and take our iceberg here. We have like about two or three pieces. It says great texture. Four or five pieces of red onion. Put our buns on top. There we go, best damn cheeseburger.